Hello everyone and welcome back to the Minecraft video and today we're going to be traveling to the airport It's going to be so fun today having to go through the airport. It's going to be quite cool Oh no, there we have like a hot air balloon and it seems to be on fire um, Should we tell someone or maybe we should just leave it? Um, but today I'm going to be placing vending machines around the airport because that's our new job for now so they told us that this airport will open up in a few days and one of the last few things before we go through security is pretty much that we had to place vending machines everywhere around the airport so when people walk through security the first thing they see are vending machines so to be able to get water to be able to get sodas to be able to get candy and something i'm still working on is the coffee machines so we have loads of coffees here there's um, a total of 12 different types of coffee um, so we have like, for example, Dunkin' Donuts coffee, we have um, Starbucks coffee here, we have Costa coffee, I'm sure this is Costa coffee 100%. Um, we have the pumpkin coffee, which is like the pumpkin cafe coffee. Um, I'm sure like all of these other ones are from different types of coffee shops. If you guys know where any of these other types are from, just like tell me down below and I would love to know. But, to be able to buy items from these vending machines, you have to have coins. So for example, the clay coin is made with four clays and a button in the middle, and that will give you 10 clay coins. The iron coins are made with four iron ingots and a button in the middle, and that will give you 10 iron coins. Then we have the gold coin, which is made with four gold ingots and a button in the middle, and that will only give us five gold coins. Now, the reason why you'd want to actually get the higher tier coins is pretty much because the clay coins They'll give you a chance of maybe nothing, or you get the lower sort of sodas. There we go, what did we get? So we got a Cola Zero. We, that didn't give us anything. Nothing again. Oh, there you go. So we got a Water. Now, as you can see, we are getting everything that is quite basic. Um, so let's see, let's just do it a couple more times. There you go, Waters. Um, like We're just getting tons and tons of Waters. Um, and a Caffeine-Free Cola. And we don't want these kind of like diet colas and caffeine free but if you go for the iron coin you'll get stuff like Fanta um, let's use another one that gave us a Sprite Zero that gave us a cola so as you can see we're getting the kind of like the higher tiers now even a chance to get some really rare items now for the gold coin you get the rare items and also the ultra rare items so let's just use a few and see what we get um, so we've got loads of vanilla col colas which are obviously better than Cola Zero, which are like different flavors and everything. We've got Cherry Cola, we've got loads of fruit juices, Powerade. So like these are just endless stuff. Um, it's gonna be so cool. And the same goes with the vending machines. You can kind of see here, we're not getting much. There we go, we've got a, well, let's put these away so we see what we get. So we've got a blue gum, like me using loads and loads and loads up. We're not getting anything. Oh, there you go, we've got another blue one and we've got a pink one and also a lime one. But if we're using up the gold coins, I mean the iron coins, you kind of see here we're getting some um, chocolate bars, we're getting some orange gum. Um, like, look at that, we're not getting much. So let's see what we get. So we've got a purple gum, pink gums, lime gums, orange gum. I'm looking for like the gingerbread man. Let's see, can we get one? What did we get? Let's keep on going until we get the gingerbread man because that's a rare item. There you go, we've got a gingerbread man. That's going to be so fun. <laughs> I love the gingerbread man. He's so cool. Let's see what he looks like in my hand. <laughs> he looks so funny in my hand. Can I see it properly? Oh, there you go. <laughs> that is crazy. That is so cool. Oh, oh, and a zombie. How did, how did he get in here? Wait, get away. I'm going to use my gingerbread man to kill you. Oh, no, 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 no. I'm on fire. I'm on fire. I'm on fire. I'm fine. I'm fine. There you go. Gosh. Don't die. That was crazy. How did he... He didn't come from the vending machine, did he? If anyone knows where he came from, he probably came from down here or something. Who knows? Um, but yeah, that was pretty cool. So, let me show you how to make these vending machines because they are quite hard to make. Um, because one of the most weirdest things is... Look, I'll show you. So, the soda vending machine um, is made with two blocks of iron a glass pane, a redstone, a button, and any sort of like cola, diet cola, um, caffeine free cola, cola zero, um, vanilla cola, cherry cola, or Fanta, Mountain Dew, Sprite, Sprite zero, or Powerade or fruit juice. So just replace any of those with any sort of like the items you can find or the items you can make. But the great thing is that there are recipes for these items. So for example, um, to make the fruit juice, it's water, 
an apple, some sugar, and a carrot. So this is obviously one of those mixed fruit um, juices from like the store that you can find, which are pretty cool. But for example, the power aid is made with a water, a lapis azuli, a sugar, and a golden apple. Let's just do a couple more because like the recipes for these items is crazy. So for the water, it's a button and two water bottles. The normal cola is made with a water bottle, two sugars, and a cocoa beans. Then we have like the Fanta, which is made with an orange dye, a sugar, an apple, and a water. And then which other ones haven't we done? Let's do this uh, Sprite here, which is made with water and just sugar, which is like one of the easiest ones to make. Um, and then I think that's okay. Like all the coffees don't have recipes at the moment because like, you know, Starbucks don't want me to know how to make their like frappuccinos or anything. So for now, there are no recipes on those items. But for example, the gingerbread man has no recipe. The chocolate bar has no recipe. The gum do have recipes. So whichever one you want to make, you just replace it with like the color of it and a sugar in the middle. So for the orange one, it's an orange dye. For the purple one, it's purple dye and sugar in the middle. Um, for the pink one, it's pink dye and sugar in the middle. For the blue one, it's lapis lazuli with a sugar in the middle. So you kind of get the idea on how to make the bubble gums because they're quite easy. But of course, some items like the chocolate bar have no recipes, which is kind of a shame. And yeah, so they all kind of give like different boosts too. So it's kind of crazy. We've got speed two for a few seconds. Let me go ahead and just like run around and see what happens. But it's just so cool that you get like a bit of a sugar rush, which is why I had the sprint option. So it's kind of kind of cool. And I don't think the bubble gum will give me much. Let's see. There you go, nothing. So some item will give you boosts and some won't, but besides that, it's not that bad at all. And then to be able to make the candy vending machine, um, you need a vending machine stand, which is made with three iron ingots and a block of iron. And then the top of the vending machine is made with a two blocks of iron, a glass pane, a button, an iron ingot, and you just put any sort of gum that you can make. So purple gum, blue gum, um, lime gum, orange gum, pink gum, yellow gum, a red gum, a gingerbread man if you find one, and a chocolate bar if you find one to make the top of the vending machine, which is kind of cool. So I know that a lot of people will go to like this gate, which is um, gates B8 to 14. So I know loads of people are gonna be walking over here. So let's go ahead and let me just place one by the first gate, or here the first gate. So I'm gonna place one here and one here. There we go. This is going to be quite cool because people that will be waiting for these gates will be like, hmm, I wouldn't mind some candy or something. So guys, thank you so much for watching this video. If you have any questions, please post them below. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe. And I'll see you very soon with another video. Peace out.